Windsor, Colorado is one of the fastest growing cities in Northern Colorado. If you're thinking about moving to Windsor and wanna know what the best things about living there is, this is the video for you. Let's get started. Hi there, Christy Lee here, and I am a local real estate agent in the state of Colorado, but more importantly, I am a native of Colorado. If you're new to my channel, all of my videos are catered to help you figure out where the best place to live is, to take your kiddos, any of that good stuff. If that's something that interests you, please click that subscribe button right there. That way you are notified every time I have a new video. As much as I love making these, I love talking to you more. So there is my contact information. Please reach out anytime. I would love to talk to you. All right, so today I'm gonna to be talking about Windsor, Colorado and why it is so awesome. Like, why is everybody moving there? Because it is growing like crazy. It's actually one of the fastest growing cities in Colorado, and here is why. First one, location. The location of Windsor is actually pretty prime. If you live there, you are going to be within minutes of Fort Collins, Greeley, and Loveland. You're also only about an hour away from Denver as well as an hour away from Estes Park and so Rocky Mountain National Park if you're a camper, um, hiker, anything like that. That is only an hour away. Windsor is just a really great location maybe if you work in Fort Collins or even even Greeley and don't want to live maybe in Greeley or don't want to pay Fort Collins prices. Windsor is going to be a great great place for you to live. So like I said, it is growing. In fact, right now they are at 35,000 people in population, but just 10 years ago, that was about 10,000 less people. So I mean, it is growing rapidly. Windsor is about 26 square miles, so it is pretty small still, and it actually still doesn't have that small town feel, but people are gravitating towards this area mainly because of the price point of homes out there. So right now we're in May of 2023. Median house price out in Windsor is gonna be roughly low 600. So you're gonna get a lot more home than you would maybe in Denver for sure. I mean, median house price right there is about 850, 850,000. But even if you go start even going north, Thornton, Erie, all those areas are gonna be quite a bit more than Windsor as well. So people are gravitating towards this area mainly for price point. And what is so great is that there's so many real estate opportunities out in this area because if you get in now, things are just gonna progressively just get better, right? So people are gonna gravitate, meaning that your house is gonna be worth more in the long run. So you get in early, build up that equity in your home, and it's gonna be great for when you sell down the road. Windsor absolutely loves entertaining. They love their community and they love entertaining their community. They have what is called the Boardwalk Community Park, which is actually located right around uh, the Windsor Lake. And that's where a lot of their activities and community events take place. They have concerts in the park. They have movies in the park. Um, up and down Main Street, they are gonna have a lot of things going on right there. Farmers markets, art, art artists markets, um, things like that. They just love, you know, love to bring the community together. And that's one thing I will say about Windsor as well as their boardwalk. Um, community park is so unique to Windsor. It's actually, I don't feel like I've ever seen one of these in Colorado for that, for that matter. It is really, really cool. I mean, you have the lake out there, you have actual like a beach area in in Colorado, which is great, in Northern Colorado. So you have like this beach and you know, volleyball and people are walking around and you have just that whole kind of California vibe in a sense, but it is in Northern Colorado, which is just very, very unique. Windsor also loves outdoors and they have a uh, 62, acres of land out there that open space so they're you know they have so many spaces that you could go out and run and walk your dog 
you know, hike, all of those kind of things are all taking place within Windsor because they absolutely love their residents to get out and enjoy nature. Another thing I absolutely love about Windsor is that they love their local businesses. They take care of their own. So you're gonna have like three or four breweries just offhand. So if you're somebody who likes micro brews, Windsor has it. You're gonna have quite a few little cute coffee shops and ice cream shops and things like that. They don't have those big box stores. I mean, you're gonna have like, you know, the King's, or excuse me, the, uh, the McDonald's and the Wendy's and things like that, but you will not have a Walmart in Win uh, Windsor. You will not have a Target in Windsor. Those places, if you need those places, you're gonna have to go out to Fort Collins or Loveland Greeley to get to those bigger box chain areas or stores because Windsor just doesn't have it. They take care of their own. They have really great restaurants that are locally owned, that are like locally sourced. I mean, this is an agricultural area, Windsor is, so they really do take into account all of their local goods and they utilize that within their community. And that's one thing I absolutely love about Windsor. So those are a few of the things I think you should definitely consider before you know making, making it a point to figure out where you wanna move. Definitely consider Windsor. They have amazing communities out there. If you're a golfer, they have out there, they have great golf courses out there too. I mean, Windsor is just growing great communities, great things to offer. And it just offers that small town cute feel, um, but you're still so close to other things that you don't feel so secluded. You, you are still very much a part of everything else in the community. So definitely reach out to me if you have any questions about Windsor or about any other area for that matter. I am here to help. Remember to click that subscribe button right there. That way you are notified every time I have a new video. And then to the next video, take care.